Welcome to the Meet the Coach series in honour of Executive Coach Day. I'm delighted to be joined today by Marie. Hi, Marie. Hi. How are you doing? I'm very well. And yourself? Very good. Very good. I'm going to get straight into the questions I want to ask you. And the first one is, what sort of people do you like to coach? Who's your ideal coach or your client? Wow. Wow. Okay. So... I really love the whole um, team coaching element, that kind of different perspectives in a room working together collectively to sort of unpick concerns and solutions and discover solutions. But I really um, love to connect with the one-to-one coach, um, that experience face-to-face, one-to-one, so we we can actually go deeper. Um, And of course, if we have the opportunity to bring my creative sight into the room so that we can start to draw and build, you know, collages. Uh, that also brings an extra dimension to my practice. Some of my clients have been uh, leaders on executive levels in pharma. Um, more often than not, it's about developing different mindsets, um, thinking about changing maybe practices in their work and what they're doing, dealing with their teams as well. Maybe that's around com- confidence and communication. That can be that. So with that in mind, have you got a particular uh, coaching relationship that you've had that you're just really pleased with the outcome from? Well, yeah, there was one client and I've actually got a, a little bit of a testimony that she um, sent me. So would it? So she said, working with Marie as an executive coach has been one of the most impactful partnerships of my lifetime. She has truly helped me to change my mindset, develop new behaviours and habits so that I can have even greater impact on leading people, teams, and building connections with stakeholders. This year I'm on fire, and I attribute that to the experience that I've had with Marie. Wow, 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 wow. That's an amazing testimonial and really speaks to what you bring. So so you're part of the Diverse Executive Coach Directory, and um, I'm curious to learn from you why you think diversity in coaching is important. It's important because... People from the global majority can show up in a space and truly be themselves. They can feel safe in that space. And if when they're actually with a diverse coach, that's a psychologically safe space. That's a space where they can trust, where they can feel the respect um, and certain levels of shared journeys as well. So it's very important for coaches from diverse backgrounds to be in space with clients who can they can connect with and go for a, a deep on a deeper level. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Couldn't agree more. Um, and my final question to you um, is what sort of what book would you recommend to any leader? Um, yeah. What's the one book that you think, oh, that should be on your bookshelf? Well, there's a book um, called... Um, Black Faces in High Places. Yes, that's right. <laughs> um, it's by Jeffrey um, Robinson and Randall Pinkett. And it's basically a book for black professionals with some strategies and some actions to get to high places and actually stay there. But what I think would be really interesting is for leaders to read that book and f- understand, get an awareness and an understanding of the experience that some of these, um, some of the black professionals are going through in on their journey on their professional journey and there's some of those strategies that they may be able to support them with too amazing what a great recommendation really really helpful it's been lovely to speak with you marie thanks so much thank you